really excited to be at my first uh, Big 12 Media Day. We're going to go play, and we're going to play with pride, and we're going to play for one another. I am joined by Longhorn Center, Dom Espinoza. Malcolm Brown, University of Texas, yeah. running back. Cornerback Diggs, cornerback. Cedric Reed, defensive end. But our mission is very simple. We want to make sure we graduate players. We want to make sure we go win a championship. Good job and a nice smile. It was pretty good, man. You know, it was a lot of questions asked. You know, I saw a lot of great players walking around. I saw some head coaches from the conference, man. It was it was just a great day overall. It's been fun, and I, I I've enjoyed it. You know, being able to be one of the guys that come strong. You know, pick to come here. If the head guy wants you to come to this thing, he, he definitely trusts you and he definitely has respect for you. And it's just something I got to be thankful for. It was cool. Definitely an honor, you know, um, for the coaches and, and whoever picked me to just really have that have the respect for me and have and trusted me to come out here and, and answer questions representing Texas. We're not satisfied with how we've been finishing over the past couple of years, and we want to get back to where we're winning championships and playing in big games. So that's what I was kind of trying to stress today. There you go. There you go. Good. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Man, I don't know what they was doing in there, but um, it was some weird looking stuff they were doing. They, I saw two stiff guys in that dance, and Sid and uh, Malcolm, they, they probably the stiffest guys come through this Big 12 media day. Quandre likes to uh, over exaggerate things and uh, make it seem like a lot worse than what it is. You know, I'm 6'6, six, six, so. Getting the boogie on is kind of hard for, for the tall guys to do. Them little guys like Malcolm and Quinchay was getting their boogie on in there. Nah, oh, man, they just told me to start having fun with it, so I'm just I'm just in there just dancing, and I was going to the little little music they had playing in the background. I was just going to that little beat that I heard. Man, I'm a little smooth, man. Nobody nobody really knows, but I, I had to show it off just a little bit tonight. I think Malcolm was really into it. I think Quandre, I mean, he's always like that, so I don't I don't rate him there high. But he, I, I kind of think I surprised some people, and then said it was just. He was terrible. You know, I went in there, I did my thing the way I was supposed to. And then my guy Dom went in, he kept everybody entertained. A lot to look forward to when it comes to subtle celebrations. You can coin me on that term. It'll be big next year. Subtle celebrations. I just wanted people to know that, you know, that we're working hard. Most of the guys, they've all bought into this system. And that, that's the best thing about it. And our responsibility is to win games, and that's what's important to us. I was, I was just saying that, that we're here ready to work and that we're uh, that you're going to see a different different Texas team next year. I feel like you need to come up here and show what kind of what the team is feeling like, what the staff is feeling like, because you're you're you know you're you're chosen here to come talk for for the team really. So I think that's important, and it's really good, important to get that message across and show people that you know we are planning on being the real deal this year. That's it. And that's a wrap.